Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Angie and today we're doing something a little different. As you can see, it's not my normal time of day. I didn't realize the sun would just come through like that, but it is an unpaid actor in this video. We are going to be unboxing my aesthetic dollar order. You know I have been saving up for this with my AD savings challenge. So I just took off the top half of the box. It obviously didn't come like this. So let's hop right into it. She always includes these cute little things. Got myself a paper clip. Thank you. Okay, my full name's Angelina, but it's okay. It's okay. She's such a queen. So, alrighty. So I did purchase a little, little something, otherwise known as the chic wallet. So let's go ahead and unbox that. So I got the color black. And this is what it looks like. So I did already kind of open this and take a peek. But yeah, look at that. That's awesome. I am so excited. We are going to set this up and um, move over my setup from my A7 wallet to my A6. So let's put that to the side. And I also got something else. I got her two new dashboards. So I got this for A6 and I got this for my A5. I normally don't use my A5 on camera, but I actually do use it for budget planning. And I just, I love this dashboard. I think it's so pretty. So I got two of the same. Um, so we're gonna set that up. All right, so first my A5 binder, she doesn't get a lot of screen time. As you can see, I already have some um, dashboards in here. So I like these a lot, but I'm actually gonna switch them out. Um, this expense tracker was something I was trying out in January, I guess. I don't know what happened there. But yeah, as you can see, this is kind of where I um, budget my, save, uh, not my saving challenges, but just my cash stuffings for the week and what they all are. Obviously, um, this is a blank piece of paper. I wish it was maybe like the dotted grid, kind of like a bullet journal. I'm gonna see what I can do here. This has been working for me. I'm um, just kind of like jotting it down, but I wish this was a little more set up, more organized, a little more aesthetic, if you will. So let's see what I can do. I like this um, budget clear one. Maybe I'll put the moon behind it. So this is the 2024. And then this is the A5, let's see. Don't wanna bend it. Wow, so pretty. Okay. Oh, that's actually really cool. It's like the circle, that's circling the moon. Love that. I'm gonna get a closer look. That's really pretty and I think it matches well with the black. So my A5 is all set. All right, so here's my binder that I'm currently using. It's my A7 binder. This has been serving as my wallet. So let's see what we can do here. I am switching to an A6 now. I think I wanna put this dashboard in my wallet but I might save it for my marble binder. I think it'll look really nice in there. So. I did go to the casino. We did, me and my boyfriend did our little getaway. Um, I did not win anything. I have $13 left over. So that's gonna go in my wallet rollover fund. <laughs> I guess I'll do this now in this video. I do have some coins. This is not a cash stuffing, but we might as well. Okay, so these are all the coins that I have and I'm gonna put that in my jar off camera. All right, so. Let's take out these envelopes. The only envelope that I have money in is I just put the leftover in my spending. Okay, and then these as well. Okay, so I'm gonna start swapping some of my cards off camera and then I'll cut to after. Okay, so I transitioned the most important cards that I have in here. Obviously, um, my ID I keep in the back of my phone, so that's fine. Um, she didn't have the fly leaves available for this. I may look into getting that. You know, obviously, I want to see how I like this whole setup 
and all of that but i actually do have a surprise for you before that here is the a7 contents and here is my a7 wallet all empty oh oh my gosh it's been a journey okay so let's move this to the side all right so for my a6 wallet i figured it would only be um, appropriate to have a6 envelopes so i you know i have been making my own envelopes so i did make some of my own envelopes here for my a6 wallet so actually this first one here is not for my a6 wallet this is going in my green binder but from just from experience of these envelopes um i just figured i know which ones i'm using which ones i'm not so here's what I'm including in my wallet. I'm going to have spending, gas, eating out. Oh, and then I was supposed to have miscellaneous, but <laughs> I cut this one a little short. So I'm thinking, eh, I may just keep it in here and switch it out when I care. Um, <laughs> just to be frank. Um, but I also have this blank envelope I made that's actually the right size. So I don't know what I'm going to do yet. So let's put these in. Yeah, I think I'm going to do without the miscellaneous one just because I like the cut of these. So we have spending, gas, eating out, and then this will be kind of our miscellaneous for now. I do have a miscellaneous envelope in my green binder, so I guess whatever I need I'll also be putting in here. And yeah, that's pretty much that. This doesn't have anything for coins, so I'm going to need to carry something for a coin pouch. And then I do have my fun fund. So this is a new envelope I'm starting. Basically, um, whenever I want to have a good time, whatever I want to do, like for instance, me and my boyfriend just went for our little getaway. Um, I figured why not start an envelope as a little fun fund. It doesn't have to be for a specific getaway to a casino or hotel or whatever it's going to be, but it could just be for anything. So let's go ahead and put this in my green binder. I have that right here. And I still have all of my envelopes right here. So I think Fun Fund will be... I think right here, right before miscellaneous. Okay, and then the next decision we have to make is, does this... A6 dashboard belong in my wallet or does it belong in my binder? Because for a wallet, I don't know necessarily if I foresee a dashboard being in my wallet. I gotta see how it looks. Because again, I think with the black, it looks so nice. I mean... Hold on, let's envision this moment. So, oh, I'm gonna pay for dinner. Bam. Hmm. You know what, we'll keep it in here for now. We'll keep it in here for now. And that is my new wallet. Oops, there's also this. All right, now it's official. Oh, that's so pretty in the lighting. Okay, and then I do have this extra gold paper clip. I think I'll just put this in here. Go to look nice on the side. Bam. There we go. And then, you know what? Let me put my wallet rollover in my wallet rollover. And we are not counting this yet. So I'm putting $13 in my wallet rollover. And we'll be counting this in the beginning of June. I think these envelopes are still holding up pretty well. Yeah, they're still nice and flat. I don't think they've um, warped yet. I know my last envelopes did warp and I was really scared of that happening this time around. But it looks like they're holding up well. It's been about a week. A little less than a week. We gotta give it some time still. Thank you so much for watching this video. This is a little 
Um, not my usual pace, but I figured I would make an extra special edition video for my order that I've been saving up for for a long time. So thank you so much, Emily and Stephanie, for packaging my order, making me feel really special about it. Um, I've been really looking forward to this, and I'm so happy about my new wallet setup. So thank you. Thank you for watching this video. If you like what you saw, please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you for our next cash stuffing. Bye-bye.